Now, your 41NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. It's been a little bit of a smoky evening here in Macon, but take a look. This is looking out on our 41 sky view overlooking downtown Dublin, where everything has really kind of stayed clear through much of the day. Earlier today, we were seeing that smoke coming in from a fire in Putnam County, so it hasn't made its way all the way down to Dublin. Enjoy your good air quality right now in Dublin because you're hopefully going to see it continue into tomorrow. Still some higher fire danger possible through tomorrow afternoon, but right now sitting at 54 degrees. Two points are in the mid 40s, so that is as cool as it can get overnight tonight, but we are seeing our winds staying pretty calm out there this evening. Right now sitting at uh, sitting in the 50s for most of us, but 79 earlier today here in Macon. So actually below normal high temperatures. 81 is normal for this time of year. We're back in the 80s tomorrow, so I hope that you enjoyed your one day break from the 80s because those are going to be back and then we're even talking about some upper 80s low 90s as we're heading into next week. We'll get there in a little bit, but you can see 62 right now in Atlanta 57 over in Birmingham and seeing 60 degrees in Montgomery as our current temperatures a little bit warmer further out to our west. But really for us, it's going to be about this high pressure that right now is over our area, but it's going to start to shift a little bit further to the east tomorrow. And as that happens, we'll see a little bit more moisture in the area. You also notice got some showers and storms further out to our west. Those are going to kind of make a play a little bit later on as we head into the weekend. So for tomorrow, we're going to see this high pressure just kind of scooch a little bit further over to the east. As that happens through the day tomorrow, we're going to start to see more easterly winds. That's going to help to bring in a little bit more moisture from the Atlantic, but it's really going to be once we head into Friday and Saturday that we see more of those southerly winds. The system to our north, this warm front right here is going to drag in a little bit more of that moisture from the Gulf, which means we are talking about more clouds potentially overnight Friday. And by Saturday, we're looking at the potential for a few scattered showers and thunderstorms. So it's something that we're watching pretty closely, but we're not expecting any kind of widespread severe weather or anything like that between now and next week. For tonight, we continue to see these mostly clear skies. Temperatures dropping to the low 50s by 5 a.m. So we head towards the 7 o'clock hour. Expect to see more of those 40s in the area, but we're going to warm up really quickly through the rest of the day tomorrow. We're back into the middle 70s by lunchtime, 80 degrees by around 3 p.m. I do think we make it even warmer than that through the afternoon. Now here's going to be kind of the big difference between what we saw today where we saw all of this dry air, more comfortable air. As we're moving into the weekend, we get back into humid and muggy categories, so it's definitely going to be noticeable. And like I said, we're also going to talk about bringing in more showers and thunderstorms possibly because you can see Saturday more scattered showers, kind of those popcorn storms like we typically see in the summertime. We're going to start continuing into Sunday and into the start of it next week. We're also going to add in more of those summertime temperatures with highs next week, getting into the upper 80s and the low 90s. So something to be prepared for as we are moving into next week. And right now it doesn't look like there's a big system that typically would take this out of our area and cool us down. So right now we're just kind of stuck in what we call zonal flow, which means more showers and storms that will be possible through much of next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll look at our seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, get oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I 75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. And here's your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7 day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. Temperatures will be staying in the low and mid 80s through the end of the week, staying dry on Friday, but by Saturday and Sunday, we're going to bring back some rain chances. Not everyone's going to see the rain, but we are expecting to see those scattered storms sticking around through next week as we warm back into the upper 80s and low 90s. For weather updates on the go, download the 41NBC AccuWeather app and follow 41NBC on Facebook and Twitter.